Hello and welcome back to Road Trivia, the once a day road trip trivia quiz. Today's episode, day number 195 of the 365 day trivia road trip. Today we have 20 questions up front and then a question 21 tiebreaker at the very end of the episode. If you need to stick around for that, all of these questions are random knowledge, so they could come from any category. Just be ready for anything. Thank you for watching, and good luck on today's quiz. Question number one. Name either of the months in which every place on Earth has a day in which there are 12 hours each of sunlight and darkness, the so-called vernal and autumnal equinoxes. Name either of the months, or both months if you're really good. The answer is March and September. Question number two. Queen Anne of England belonged to the House of Stuart. Edward IV belonged to the House of York. Of what royal house was King Henry VIII of England a member? The answer is the House of Tudor. Question number three. Founded at a 1945 San Francisco conference, it was an agreement by countries to coordinate policies after World War II. What was the name of this organization based in New York that works on global issues? The answer is the United Nations, or the UN. Question number four. The library was part of a larger research institution that was known as the Museum. In what Egyptian city was this library established under the reign of Ptolemy II, which became one of the largest and most significant libraries of the ancient world? The library in question is the Library of Alexandria. Alexandria is the answer. Question number five. The third film in Academy Award show history to win The Big Five. What was the title of the 1991 film starring Jodie Foster that was the first and is still the only horror movie to win the Best Picture Oscar? Some people say Parasite was a horror film, but the director called it a black comedy. So the only horror movie to ever win the Best Picture Oscar was Silence of the Lambs. Question number six. Including the songs Bring Him Home, Do You Hear the People Sing, and I Dreamed a Dream, what is the name of the musical that is based on a Victor Hugo work about 19th century France? The answer is Les Miserables. Question number seven. In this Asian nation of approximately 100 million, the use of French as an administrative language has been in steady decline since the end of colonial rule. What is this nation, united in 1976 after 30 years of civil war and struggles with France and the United States? United in 1976, the answer is Vietnam. Question number eight. This term can refer to the study of books and the term means book writing. An annotated one gives descriptions about how each source was useful to an author in constructing their writing. What is the name of this list of references in the back of a report? Thank you.
The term we're looking for is a bibliography. Question number nine. This element, discovered in 1807 by Sir Humphrey Davy, has a melting point of 98 degrees Celsius and can be isolated using the Downs process. What is this alkali metal, element number 11, with the symbol NA? NA is sodium. Question number 10, there are about 7.48 of these in a cubic foot, 42 of these in a barrel of crude oil, and 26.4 of these in a hectoliter. What is this unit of volume equal to 128 fluid ounces or four quarts? The answer is a gallon. Question number 11. Developed at Bell Labs and still one of the most common computer operating systems in use today, what is the name of the computer operating system that was coined by Brian Kerninghan as a pun on the name Multix? It's not Multix, it is Unix. Unix is what we're looking for. Question number 12. In 1677, he made the first full observation of a transit of Mercury. He believed comets followed elliptical paths around the sun and predicted the comet of 1680 would return in 1758. What is the name of this scientist whose comet returned again in 1986? The comet is Halley's Comet. His name is Edmund Halley. Question number 13. What was the title of the 2015 space opera that starred Mila Kunis in the title role whose life is turned upside down when an interplanetary warrior, played by Channing Tatum, informs her that her destiny extends beyond Earth? The answer is Jupiter Ascending. Question 14. Though they were both married to other people, this famous movie couple's on-screen charisma was palpable in the 1990s, making their movies box office gold. What pair acted together in Sleepless in Seattle, You've Got Mail, and Joe vs. the Volcano? The answer is Meg Ryan and Tom Hanks. Question 15. The United States acquired the territories of California, Nevada, Utah, and parts of New Mexico, Texas, Arizona, Colorado, and Wyoming as a result of which armed conflict that occurred from 1846 to 1848? The answer is the Mexican-American War. Question number 16. These planes downed more enemy aircraft than any other Allied fighter in World War I. The cowling over the two Vickers machine guns ahead of the cockpit created a distinctive hump which led to the Sopwith F-1 plane receiving what nickname, although it was never an official military designation? That hump led the plane to being called the camel. Question number 17. 
Known as the Crossroads of the Pacific, this port city serves as the stopping point for ships and planes crossing the Pacific Ocean. Located on the island of Oahu, what is the capital and largest city of Hawaii? The answer is Honolulu. Question number 18. Several of these are present within a molecule of methane, as the four valence electrons and the four hydrogen electrons are used. This is an example of what kind of chemical bond in which atoms share electrons. The answer is covalent bonds. Question number 19. He wore a helmet to disguise his misshapen head and he was taught by the philosopher Anaxagoras. The patron of Phidias and lover of Aspasia, he died of plague during the Peloponnesian War. What is the name of this leader of Athens during the Golden Age? The dude with the misshapen head was Pericles. Question number 20. It is peculiar because it incorporates all three orders of column, Doric, Ionic, and Corinthian. Construction on it was started by Vespasian and it was dedicated by his son Titus. Fourth century documents put its capacity at around 87,000 people. What is the name of this Flavian Amphitheater? The answer is the Colosseum. And what's cool about the Colosseum, besides the thousand years of ancient history that went on there, is it might be the scene of the biggest fight in history when Mark Zuckerberg takes on Elon Musk in the battle of the billionaires and we as a public get to watch them punch each other in the face which will be enjoyable for everybody and just add to the unique history that is the Colosseum. Can't wait to write a trivia quiz about that one after, well, if it happens and then after it happens. But anyways, new trivia every single day on this channel. Click subscribe to be notified of the new quizzes. And here comes question 21, the tiebreaker for today. In the 1965 movie musical, The Sound of Music, starring Julie Andrews and Christopher Plummer, how many children are in the Von Trapp family? Letting you add them up if you've ever seen it. The answer is seven kids. Rupert, Agatha, Maria, Warner, Hedwig, Johanna, and Martina. Seven Von Trapp children. I believe they added more, but in the movie, there were only seven. Thank you for watching. See you tomorrow.